Alright guys, good evening. It's, uh, what is it, Friday, December 11th, 2020. And this is the bike room, guys. This is the entrance to the bike room. First bike you're going to see is my spin cycle. This is the bike I've been training on lately. And uh, it's really a lot of fun. Super, super quiet. Great bike. There's my Trek Imanda. Uh, some jerseys. Yes, I'm a Raider fan. Bunch of tools. A uh, bunch of my accessories. Shoes, water bottles, cages. Virtually everything I need. A um, couple helmets. You guys have seen this before. This 1984 Olympics. Uh, Rory O'Reilly. A uh, great, great American cyclist. A big old stained glass with doggy. Uh, more helmets, some pictures. Uh, this is the big screen TV I've got in this particular room. There's my Salsa Journeyman. My uh, Cervelo Aspero. My Cannondale uh, Synops. So this is basically the whole room, and this is what I work out in. Oh, I don't know if you guys see my little uh, truck here, my little 4x4 truck. Oh, it's a lot of fun. Gets up to about like 22 miles an hour, so that's pretty fast for a remote control car. My Quest longboard in the back, I don't know if you noticed it. My hiking poles, a couple race numbers. Uh, this is from the Red Lens Classic, and uh, I believe the San Dimas Stage Race. Um, that's from um, the Hub Center, the Velodrome at Cal State Dominguez Hills. My exercise ball, my mat for core work. Uh, virtually everything I need to stay fit is in this room. Um, and I really, really like the way the TV set up. So when I'm doing my spin sessions, I could actually watch a big screen TV. I used to keep a little. Uh, a little tablet right here and uh, you're always looking down your neck starts to get strained so when you're climbing you got to really put your neck down so it's better just to have a big screen in front of you and I would put it directly in front but as you can see there's a door there so you really can't do that uh, but I really like spinning now it's a lot of fun um, and I get to be around everything that I love which is uh, all my bike equipment and who just walked in? That's our new, my new dog, Bambi. A super athletic, beautiful, beautiful dog. Look at how intelligent she is. She's a Queensland healer. Um, so it's a Australian herding dog. But this, this girl, she's just beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. She's one year old. She's a saved dog. Uh, her basic story is uh, she went in for some surgery because she ate something and uh, because of the cost, the owners relinquished ownership of her. Um, a great doctor by the by the name of Mrs. Fitty took care of her, nursed her back to health, and now I own this beautiful, beautiful dog. And, and I was I was looking for a new dog to replace, not to replace, but just to have another dog because my beautiful little Maltese Sandy passed away six or seven months ago, and uh, it really depressed my girlfriend. But my girlfriend fell in love with uh, Bambi, and she named her Bambi, even though she's a girl. Uh, we all know it's a boy's name, but uh, that's what she wanted, so she got to name this namer. Uh, my last couple dogs, actually all my dogs have been named by me, and uh, this was her first dog she could name herself, so I think that was fair. Anyways, guys, if you have any questions about... Uh, a spin bike or tracks or Cannondales or salsas, let me know. Um, I hope everybody's going to enjoy their weekend. Be safe out there. Please wear your mask. And uh, we'll talk to you all soon.